Welcome back. Welcome back. We're just getting ready to get our tag team match starting up for this evening. going to open up. Immediately Grayson goes right to the wrist lock and works right on that head to elbow to the face. 13 returns back the favor and 13 is going to throw Grayson to uh, his corner. 13 is going to bring Guardian in. Going to do pretty much what they always do. Toe drop or drop toe hold elbow to the back. Grace, uh, Guardian goes up there. Big snap suplex. Guardian's going to pull 13 back in. Grayson's going to go to the headlock. Eddie's going to, um, 13's going to counter it to the wrist lock. Grayson's going to counter it and going to duck onto the waist lock again and hits a Kravonk suplex. That's something, that's something out of Grayson's playbook. Maybe try and play some psycho, some psycho games with that. And Grayson's going to come back with a hammer lock. And hits that big knee buster. Grace is going to pull back and double buster. Knee to the face. And hits the uh, hits the basement drop kick to that knee. Big chop. Shot to the throat. Punch to the head. Go to the headlock. Pull back. High angle neck breaker. Jack talking trash. 13 goes to kick the uh, punch to the midsection. 13's had enough of that shit, so he's up pulling the Guardian. Grayson's like, oh, fine, to hell with it. And gonna go right and say, all right, your turn. Grayson goes to the headlock, shots to the throat, goes to the waist lock, standing switch counter, 13 card, and counters it, and hits a backside suplex of his own. Grayson picks up, uh, no, Guardian picks up Grayson, and Grayson's gonna power out of it. Grayson goes to the headlock, and right to that head kick. Big chop to the chest. Grayson goes to the wrist lock. And Damien just expressing his authority on Guardian's chest. And Guardian's going to set him up for good God. A variation like a Fisher and Suplex, but with a toss. And he had to be upside down about two or three feet from the map. From the map for that shit. They're going to lock up in the center. Guardians are a little waist lock. And he's gonna hit the teardrop suplex. Guardians are roll over and gonna go right to that uh, leg submission and oh into the uh, El Paso Lasso and Guardian and Grayson's not gonna have it. Chopped to the chest, Grayson's gonna go to the waist lock, standing switch. And high angle neck breaker once again. Kicks to the midsection, goes to the headlock. Gar 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 Garden's encounter to the headlock of his own and then throw Grace into the corner to get 13 in there. Because it's been all Gar it's been all Grace in this match so far. And after the detract here, um, you're gonna hit drop toe hold with the elbow to the back. And uh, no idea what that was. Body scissors to the face.
And 13, and a kick to the midsection. Thirteen goes to the cover. Grayson's gonna kick out. And Grayson hits that running elbow to the face, but 13's gonna come back with a clothesline. Thirteen. Thirteen to the waist lock. And thirteen gonna pump handle oh. Good God. Oh, that's a pump handle follow away slam. And thirteen rolls in the double um Double head kick. 13 rolls over Grayson. Here's a cover. One. Grayson's going to kick out. 13 going to bring in Guardian. And Grayson trying to get to the corner to get Jeff in. And just as he goes to tag, Guardian catches him. And Guardian drops the elbow on Grayson. Grayson Gray, uh, Guardian goes to the cover. One. Grayson kicks out, and Guardian's gonna get his hands on Grayson. It's gonna hit that, and Grayson has been knocked out just as he was going to try and drag in Jeff. Great, uh, freaking the Guardian sneakily grabs because Jeff was getting back in position for the tag. And just as he was reach out to tag it, Guardian catches him, sets him up with the, for the whirly gig, and Grayson. Thirteen and Guardian. So Jeff really didn't get in that match, but Grayson didn't really make an attempt except for the last one as Shane gets set up for their match. That could be the all be uh would be the NB. This is round two. And hopefully Shane can get the best of Sam. And Sam is getting ready just as well in their own particular ways. So a lot has riding in this match. Not this one in particular, but their final installment next week. So. This will lay to the advantage to Sam or the advantage to Shane. And anything I technically, even if it does, it all will be null and void because it all comes down in next week. So it's just the uh, Shane to try and get a little uh, one-upsmanship on Sam because he was utterly dominated by Sam last week. So. making his legendary status among as long as since he's been here. He's been trying to steal the spotlight from a lot of the other stars. Trying to say that he's the next big thing and he's got some credibility but he's not per he's not perfect. Because he has been beat a couple times.
as Sam begins his eerie walk down the line. Not much has to be further said about him. He shows up, he hurts people, and goes from there. So it'll be interesting how this one goes. Teacher. of that individual and you see he, uh, he's all business. behemoths coming into play. Here we go. Shane immediately goes to the waist lock, standing switch. Shane going to throw Sam into the corner and going to pick Sam up, put him on the top of the rope. Big right hand. And Shane, Eiffel Tower DDT. Uh, Eiffel Tower neck quicker, I'm sorry. And J Sam's going to come back and go for that clothesline, but Shane's going to surprise him and hit the counter with a hip toss. Sam goes to the headlock. And elbow to the face. Stomps on him. And Sam hits the rolling wheel kick. I should say Shane hits his rolling wheel kick. And Sam... Ready, but Shane is doing tactics there, and Shane's gonna punch him in the face. And Shane gonna missile drop kick into the ring. Cortana, I'm not talking to you. Stop it. And Shane's gonna break down the announce table because he wants to lay out Sam after Sam apparently well, Sam planted him in the center of the ring last week, so. Sam comes back and clothesline down, big right hand. Rolls over, elbow to the face. Shane's gonna hit the leg drop. Sam does under, Shane dives back in. Sam's gonna run around back to the outside of the ring. And Shane's gonna catch him, but if Sam's gonna catch him, it'll pull back. Single arm spine buster stomps on him. Shane goes to the headlock. Big knee lift. Shane gonna dump Sam over the top because he really wants him to get to that table. Hits there and hits the guillotine on the rope, sending Sam crashing to the floor below. Drops the elbow, big right hand. Sam's gonna catch him. But Shane's gonna counter it to the waist lock, standing switch. And he's gonna throw Sam into the barricade. And headbutt, nobody wins. Elbow drop, Sam rolls away. Sam goes to the wrist lock. And Sam throws Shane into the barricade. Sam, after those couple shots to the head, have made him woozy as Shane's an eat a pole. And 
Sam. Gonna bounce him off the pole a couple more times. Shane gets back up. Sam gets back in the ring. But Shane's gonna be waiting for him. But Sam uh, uh, intercepted it. Saw how he was doing and knocked him off and then sent him back. Punched in the face. Lay across the throat. Sam gonna duck under. Shane's gonna duck under. Sam's up top. Sam gonna go to the waist lock, but Shane's gonna counter from elbow to the face. And goes for a right hand, but Sh uh, Sam's gonna counter it. And then Shane's gonna counter to the headlock. And Sam's gonna eat a barricade. And Shane headbutt. Nobody wins once again. Drops the elbow. Shane tells Sam to eat some more steps, goes to the headlock. Sam eats the chair steps as well. Big right hand, and oh, god damn! I thought he was a DDT him through the steps, but no. Hits the over, um, the over castle DDT on the outside. Sam's been busted open. And Sam's gonna explode out of the corner of the clothesline on desperation, but. Shane's gonna hit the left corner, left punch, and Shane's dragging Sam to the announce table because he wants to put him out. Shane is gonna put Sam onto the announce table. Shane gonna go up top. What's he got in mind? Big elbow drop through the table. Drops the elbow again. Sam rolls away, and Sam comes out of the DDT of his own. Sam, big right hand, goes for the headlock. Shane's gonna counter it. Shane gonna throw Sam back in the ring. Drops the elbow, hits another leg drop of his own. Sam's reeling, he's been busted open. Shane has the advantage. Shane gonna roll over Sam. Sam's gonna get up and Shane, gonna hit the cutting edge. And that might spell defeat there for Sam. Here's the cover. One. Sam's going to kick out at one. Big right hand. and Oh, big right hand. He thought he stunned it, but no. Sam was able to counter it. Shane's going to come back with a headlock of his own. Sam's going to counter to another headlock. Sam. It's a vertical suplex. Sam going to drop the elbows. Sam just trying to finish off Shane here, but he goes to the waist lock, standing switch. Sam going to pull back, sidewalk slam. And Sam going to hit the moonsault. That's a 325 pound dude doing that. I'm sorry, 290. And Sam is going to plant Shane once again. Will that be enough? Here's the cover. Here's the cover. One, two, three. Sam inserts his dominance. Even though he wins this match, it's all set up for next week. Sam installing his dominance on Shane. Asserts his dominance. But it all comes down to next week. Where the winner goes to spoils and enters the tournament. So. But it's time for our main event of the evening. Pinning up Radiance against one of our other divas. And our another main event match.
Radiance has put on a clinic, and the matches for the last several weeks have been awesome, to say the least. She's won some, she's lost some, but by God, it's been good. By God, King, it's been good. So. In this match, who knows how it's going to play out. Raw Radiance won. Radiance awaits her competitor for the evening. that could go with this. It's Radiance versus the former FCW Women's Champion, Sabrina Danger Styles. Sabrina has been a legendary force here in the FSCW. She's battled the best. She's won and she's lost. But this could start up a whole different ball game between these two. Mm -hmm. So here we go, that big proportions. Here we go. And apparently, uh, the camera guys are doing dumb stuff. We hope and Radiance opens up with a suplex right out the gate. Radiance goes to the wrist rock. Radiance is gonna do a pull back elbow to the face. Sabrina's gonna push Radiance away. Sabrina goes to the headlock and hits a gut wrench. Gut wrench power bomb. Sabrina goes to the wrist lock. They're gonna hit the double underhook, and Radiance is fighting it, but you can't get it off, so she's just gonna dump Radiance over the, out of the way. Sabrina goes to the waist lock, goes that, no, oh, God! Knee right to the neck. Sabrina goes right to the knee. Sabrina, pull back face buster, or wrestling, uh, just a takedown, and drops Radiance on her face. Sabrina throws Radiance in the corner. <clears throat> Big shoulder thrust. Big shoulder thrust. Sabrina putting Radiance up top. And Sabrina gonna go, what you got in mind here? She's going for a vertical suplex. Super style. Off the top. Sabrina goes to the headlock. And Sabrina's gonna hit the gut wrench power, uh, the gut wrench gut buster. She's a pun handle gut buster, my bad. Sabrina's gonna tear down the announce table. <clears throat> and Sabrina, Radiance gets distracted slightly and eats a missile drop kick to the face. Sabrina picks up Radiance, revs up to a three count. Sabrina drops the elbow. And the revs up to a four count. Sabrina heads back to the ring and walks right into a belly to belly, belly to back suplex. And Radiance gonna get that sit out power bomb and walk right into another Juran suplex. Radiance, that single arm power bomb is Radiance all over Sabrina early on here. Radiance is gonna go to the waist lock, pull back, take her down. Radiance 
throw Sabrina into the corner. And oh, Sabrina's again there and hit the German suplex, dropping Radiance right on her head. That's a high angle. <laughs> Sabrina comes down with a leg lariat. And Sabrina, snap suplex. And Sabrina gonna step out and she's gonna go, is she gonna, what she, oh dear God, cross body. Lateral press, but nobody home. Reigns moves slightly to the ropes and put her out of range of Sabrina's crossbody attack, but Sabrina's gonna duck under, hit a snap German. And Sabrina gonna go back over top, try it again. Crossbody leg layer, uh, vaulting crossbody. Gets it this time, Sabrina hitting all four of them. Hits it, but Radiance is gonna roll away from that one. Sabrina crashed and burned. Radiance rolls over Sabrina, Sabrina pushes Radiance back. And Sabrina's gonna do another snap shirt German suplex. <clears throat> and belly to back suplex. It's a suplex back. Sabrina going up top. Big elbow to the top. Here's a cover one. Oh, Radiance gonna kick out at one. Big right hand. Sabrina, snap suplex. Reigns gonna fight back, punch Sabrina in the midsection, big shoulder takedown. And gonna put a butterfly lock, but Sabrina's in the ropes. They lock up in the left corner. Sabrina gonna go to the waist lock. Big L, right, another knee right to the back of Radiance's head. And Sabrina gonna tee off. Sabrina just teeing off on Radiance. And Sabrina gonna try again and hits it, but Sabrina's but Sabrina's gonna burn again. Radiance rolls out of way, and she's gonna put Sabrina into the hold. Sabrina, will she get to the ropes? She looks like it's forever. Sabrina's running out of time, and Sabrina's gonna tap. Radiance is gonna win. Sabrina ran out of time. She tried pulling Radiance from all the way to the other side of the ring. But Sabrina went to the well one too many times. And Radiance is going to take the victory. <clears throat> what a match between uh, Radiance and Sabrina Danger Styles. Sabrina went to the well one too many times and it cost her in the end. But regardless, another classic. But like all old school TV programs, they have to be they have to end. As for us, that time is now. Thank you all for tuning in once again here on the FSCW network. And join us here on pre-flight. I am Cobble S. Cobble saying have a good night and we shall see you on the next flight.